everyone, welcome back to the channel and today I have another unboxing for you guys. Today I'm going to be unboxing something different, something a lot more, uh, well, real is the better word for it because today I am going to be unboxing Faces of Death on Blu-ray, the 30th anniversary edition, yeah. This is Faces of Death in the Flesh. Banned in 43 countries, the ultimate taboo. So, if you guys don't know, let me give you a history rundown of Faces of Death, considering I have another channel that you, many of you may know about that touches on very... Uh, raunchy, very gory topics. I'm not going to get into it here because this is a family friend. Well, I mean, you can only be so family friendly when talking about Faces of Death. But anyways, Faces of Death was a movie from 1980, 1979 actually that came out on VHS. I don't know if it came out on theaters or not, but it's pretty much a doc or a shockumentary um, if you want to call it that, or a documentary or a Mondo documentary that talks about death. Yes, just the various ways people have died, and it shows you both real-life footage of death, but be noted that there's also many, many staged moments of death in this movie. Yes, many fake things are made that seem so real that many people thought back in the day that this movie was so real and so genuine that it was banned in 43 countries. Uh, you can only find it on VHS very rarely sometimes. Um, it, it's so hard to come across this movie on physical media. It's on, it's on a, a, you can find it on websites. I think you can find it on YouTube actually. But uh, it's really hard to come across a physical copy, but I managed to snag the Blu-ray of all things. So I'm so stoked to see this. Uh, the Ultimate Taboo, the original Faces of Death. Here's the spine. I was just about to open it without showing you guys the back. Here it is, the original Faces of Death. New HD, re new HD transfer from extremely rare vault materials featuring new extras that reveal the shocking truth behind all the footage. All right, let me read you guys the back. It began as a graphic exploration of the one destiny we cannot escape. It would soon become the most morally controversial, critically reviled, and financially successful documentary of the VHS era. Parent groups tried to stop it. Video stores had to hide it. Yet across the nation, millions found ways to secretly watch it, if they dared. Renowned pathologist Dr. Francis B. Gross is your guide to the most bizarre and grisly death scenes ever recorded, from executions, assassinations, and mass murder to suicide, disease, and disasters. Three decades later, it is hardcore gross out. Elaborate hoax? Oh wait, is it hardcore gross out? Elaborate hoax? Or still the ultimate forbidden movie? You may scream in shock, weep with anguish, or flee in horror but you will never forget the original Faces of Death. So yeah, this thing really hypes itself up to be like the worst thing you've ever seen, but I've seen clips of it and compared to other things that I've seen in my time of exploring films like this, it's really not that bad, honestly. But it's got some, fe it's got some special features, or as it calls them, features of death. It's got a 1080p high definition, uh, it's got an anamorphic widescreen, it's got a 5.1 audio and 2.0, and it's got English subtitles, so yeah. It's in color, it's 105 minutes. It's got feature-length commentary with director Conan Le Siller, Le Killer, Le Siller, I don't know. Choice Cuts features with editor Glenn Turner. The Death Makers feature out with effects creators. Alan A. Apone and Douglas J. White. Deleted scenes, trailer, and outtakes. So yeah, it's got a lot of stuff. It's really jam-packed. So let's open it up right now. And I'm gonna open this up on, off camera because like, I just wanna make sure the disc doesn't have some sort of like horrible image that I should not be showing on YouTube. I mean, you can never really know with these types of films, you know, they, they like to shock you right out of the way. So who knows, maybe the first time that this movie shocks you is when you open the, the 
case and it's like a picture of a dead body or something. I don't know. No, it's just... <laughs> what did I... Ex well, what, what was I expecting? It's just that. But there it is. Uh, again, banned in 43 countries. It is really proud of that, of that tagline. Uh, it was released in... This, this Blu-ray was released in 2008 by the MPI Media Group. Um, it was originally released by Gorgon Video back in the day on VHS. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much my unboxing of Faces of Death on Blu-ray. Probably my most unusual and outlandish unboxing ever. But hey, it's October, so what do you expect? Anyways, that's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I've got a ton of more spooky unboxings coming up, so stay tuned for that. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.